Okay guys, welcome back, it's Ari from Internet School. Today we are going to talk about MacQ tools. In the previous video we were talking about intermediate filaments and microfilaments, which are actin rods and other protein. In this video we are going to talk about MacQ tools. So, MacQ tools are made mainly from two types of proteins. Alpha tubulin and beta. Tubulin. The alpha and the beta tubulin come together in order to form a dimer. And this dimer come together in order to form a microtubule. Many of these dimers come together in order to form a microtubule. The microtubules have many roles in the body. But let's first talk about where they come from. So for the IMAT exam, there is a definition you have to be familiar with. MTOC, or the Microtubule Organization Center, are the source that microtubules mainly come from, or organized from. We have two main types you have to know for the IMAT. The centrosomes, and the basal bodies. The centrosomes are organelles. Let's assume this is our cell. The centrosomes are organelles made from different proteins and inside they contain two centrioles. Each centriole, if we zoom in on one, each centriole is made out of nine triple, triplets of microtubules. So we have a total of 27 microtubules in inside each centriole. And don't forget, each, cent each centrosome contains two centrioles. This is a very important fact for the IMAT. Imagine I'm cutting into half the centriole and have like a cross section. So if we look inside the centriole into a cross section, we will have nine triplets of microtubules inside the centriole. During mitosis, the centrosome is duplicate itself into two. So In total, at the beginning of mitosis, we will have two centrosomes, but four centrioles. These facts are very crucial for the IMAT because Cambridge loves to trick you in these questions. So make sure to remember how many centrioles and centrosomes are there inside the cell before mitosis and during mitosis. Remember that before mitosis we will have one centrosome which will duplicate itself to be prepared for mitosis and in mitosis we will have two centrosomes and each centrosome contain two centrioles so in total we will have four centrioles during mitosis. Also remember that the centrioles are made from nine triplets of three microtubules. The basal bodies are the microtubules organization centers of the flagellum and cilium, or in plural, cilia and flagella. A cilium and flagellum 
of two structures made out of similar structure if we cross section on the flagellum for example we will see that we have nine doublets and two doublets in the middle. This structure is called 9 by 2 plus 2 because we have nine doublets and a base, a center of another double. Please remember the difference between the microtubules organization center and the structure of the cilium and flagellum comparing to the centriole. This one is 9 times 3 of triplets, and this one is 9 times 2 plus 2. Also, it is very important to mention that I'm talking about cil a cilium and flagellum of eukaryotic cell. The prokaryotic cell has different structure and different proteins, and on the IMAT exam, they are going to ask you about the macrotubules organization center, and the cilium of and flagellum of a eukaryotic cell 99% of the time. So make sure to study and know that the cilium and flagellum of the eukaryotic cells and prokaryotic cells are different from each other and have different proteins and structure.